Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It's sure Cabalensa, Texas. Magandang magandang araw po sa inyong lahat, aking mga kababayan, mga kabalen, uh, kapilipino, kumusta po kayong lahat? <laughs> Joking aside. Now, uh, on our last video, I've noticed that one particular chicken fell on the ground really really hard and i felt terrible about it so today i was hoping uh, that we can address the problem it's gonna be a very very uh, simple fix difficulty wise from one to ten cup of rice it would be about half a cup of rice how's that for difficulty huh very very simple we probably be done in about um half an hour or an hour max but yeah it's something we have to take care of so it doesn't happen again um yeah let's go out there and see what we can come up with okay Yeah, I noticed that on the last video, as you can see, she started limping. I bought four of these back in May of 2020. I thought I would try them. They're the Jersey Giant, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because of their breed, they tend to get um, bigger, heavier. Um, they're not as agile as the other birds. So uh, yeah, let's do something about it and help her out. And maybe that one is eating a lot more than the other three. <laughs> Just joking. Please don't forget to uh, subscribe and hit the notification bell. And if you like it, hit thumbs up and leave a comment if you can. Uh, we're just starting out on this channel. We need all the help we can get. Thank you very much. Yeah, just some scrap material. I believe this one is from a uh, electrical box that I had modified a uh, while back. As you can see on the first cut, uh, it came out very clean uh, because I removed the uh, paint and primer. But on the second cut, I just went ahead and uh, plasma cut it straight up, which left uh, quite a bit of draws, but not a problem. Uh, it can easily be removed. Also give me a chance to uh, use my 2x72 uh, belt sander yeah uh, that sander is uh, well known for making knives but uh, because of its versatility I decided to build one for myself I took this video a couple of years ago um, sent it to my twin brother showing him that I successfully finished the uh, 2x72 knife grinding machine um, but I haven't made any knife yet, but uh, someday um, uh, I'm gonna have to. Now that I have tested this machine for more than two years, I can honestly say that this is the best sanding belt I have in the shop. It doesn't bug down, it's just so powerful. And the belt seem to last a lot longer than the others. Uh, so that in itself, it's a lot of savings. So yeah, I really, really like this machine.
I decided to uh, make it pivot so I can do some horizontal grinding uh, and I think also it makes it look cool this aluminum right here is from a boat I think it's part of uh, the transom I laid down right here for the final shape the pulleys the belt tensioner and the main drive are from cutoffs that I have the motor that you see right here is not the one I end up using. I opted for the uh, two horsepower, three phase uh, motor so I can control the speed. Plus, I think they're a lot stronger. Uh, these machines get very, very expensive. That's the reason why I just decided to build one. Plus, there's hundreds of people building them uh, on YouTube. So I decided I might give it a go. And so it was a very good uh, decision. I had fun. Um, I want to build another one with a single speed uh, so that way I don't have to mess with the controls just to flick it on and off uh, but the color I haven't decided yet what color I'm gonna uh, be painting it or powder coating it but uh, uh, in the future I'm gonna have to do that sorry guys I got carried away let's go back to work Using a handheld drill would be perfect here too, it's just that uh, it's quicker for me just to set it on the milling machine. That's an edge finder sitting on top of the toolbox just hanging around. I did not use that, I'm just eyeballing the holes uh, right here. It's just there um, just in case you're wondering what that was. I'm doing this right now so I can line up the screw when I install the spacers in the back which are uh, washers. Uh, I'm putting two uh, so I get more uh, gap. Uh, I do want the ladder to be removable.
Thank you very much for watching. Maraming salamat po. Um, magkita po tayo ulit sa susunod na video. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe and share. Uh, till the next one. Thank you.